Adra Army, welcome to today's show. Hope you're all well guys and I hope you enjoyed the vlogs that have happened during Christmas. I hope you enjoyed the live vlog chat we did as well. I haven't done one of those for ages, so thank you to everyone that turned up for that. If you haven't, you can watch that back at some point. And a Merry Christmas and a Happy New Year, and of course, Happy Holidays guys. Now, yesterday we went to Leon C for the first time in ages. In fact, I don't think I've been to Leon C since I was a kid. So this was a really interesting experience for me. We went there because the boss has been looking around for a new record cabinet and we couldn't find one in the furniture outlet uh, near us. So we went to Leon C because they had the specific thing that she wanted. Now, this is a bit of a gamble because that could have sold out at any time, but we were so lucky and it was there. So we picked up this furniture cabinet for the record player and then we were able to, of course, have a quick wander around. And we go past this thing called the Wild Health Calf and it was absolutely bucketing down, but we thought, why not? Let's have a look. There was no spaces inside because it's obviously quite a popular place to go. It's a vegan calf, but we waited outside for a bit. We got the takeaway service. We had it outside and trust me, it was worth it just even sitting in the rain. I had a mocha, which was their uh, coffee and chocolate mix. Um, the boss had a gingerbread latte and Badger Junior had a lovely uh, hot chocolate, all with oat milk and all natural ingredients. It was really yummy. I tried a little of all of them, to be honest with you, but my favorite has to be my mocha, but the boss definitely loved her gingerbread latte. It was really nice. Um, Badger Junior had this porridge, right? Where it was a Nutella porridge, and that was uh, chocolate, obviously, some sort of cocoa nibs type thing. Some really nice porridge, some... Uh, you know, really nice sweetened things with all different honey and all sorts of stuff like that, maple syrup and um, bananas and all sorts of stuff, almonds in there. I have the almonds. And then we did this thing where I had that and I was like, oh, actually, I want to try that, you know. So we all shared that. That was yummy. And I had some. I had got my own and the boss had um, one that was like... Um, uh, like a PB and J style thing, I guess, where it was porridge, uh, jam, and uh, and peanut butter, and that was really nice as well. I tried a little bit of that. Well, the jam was a bit sour for me, but it was all natural, so you know, if it was sweetened and stuff, I suppose it wouldn't have been as nice. But yeah, that was like wow, taste explosion. Um, it rained so bad, right, that in the end, I took a look round, and there were spaces. In the, ash, in the actual calf. So then we scurried around, carried everything and brought it in. <laughs> so yeah, we got to experience the outside garden, which was really nice. Uh, the toilets were in good condition as well. They were nice as well. And inside was lovely and warm and the staff were really kind, very helpful and very approachable and very chatty. They apologized that it uh, took a long time for the porridge, but it was all freshly made and all that sort of stuff. And by the end of it, I was absolutely stuffed. I couldn't eat another morsel for most of the day. So that was really good. <laughs> yeah, this massive bowl of porridge and this really nice coffee. So the customer service was great. Uh, everyone was really kind. I really digged the vibe and the atmosphere there. It was really fun and a really nice place to go as well. I could sit there and chill out for a few hours. It's the sort of place where you feel welcomed to chill out and relax there. You know, it's not somewhere where you felt in a rush, you didn't feel that you had to go quick or anything like that. And uh, it's somewhere where I would definitely try some of the other stuff on the menu, as I have dabbled with being a vegan before. I thought it was quite fun to have a look into that. And with Veganuary coming up, maybe it uh, give me an excuse to try again having some nice fresh food like that might inspire me again. Tell me about the fact that, what you think, would you go in a vegan restaurant? Would you go in a vegan cafe? What would you have if you went there? Let me know in the comments. And before we go, I'm gonna give this place the, the wild, wild score of 
8 out of 10. The customer service was fantastic. The uh, food was yummy. The atmosphere was great. Spot on place to go and visit if you're ever in Lee on Sea. Thanks for watching, guys, and I'll see you next time. Bye. Mr. Slender, yes. Bring me a dream. Bum, bum, bum. Do, 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 do. That I've ever seen. Bum, 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 bum. Please move. It's your magic dream. Mr. Slendy, bring me a dream. Bum, 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 bum.